welcome back if you're new here welcome to the channel my name is Nick I also go by ninja Nick and this is my brother one hit Rick aka Ricky they call me one hit Rick because everyone who messes around with me I knock them out in one hit except for me and this is our friend Rohan TV if you're not subscribed to him or us I don't know what you're doing click the subscribe button make it say subscribe it did today we are in Albany the home of not much literally there's not much here guys there's barely anything a few pieces of grass a few trees and that's it but for some reason they have the world's biggest Walmart right here from the outside nothing spectacular honestly one of the softest looking Walmarts I've ever seen so tiny man this thing looks like it has like a few vegetables in there and that's it but it is over a quarter of a million square feet in there it has two stories an upper level a lower level not sure what to expect but apparently it's massive I don't know how but somehow it's the world's biggest because it's the world's biggest Walmart the boys have to try to make the world's biggest fort in there. We gotta go with the world's biggest, guys. You know when we make toilet paper forts, we already make them super big. But when we have the opportunity to go in the world's biggest Walmart, we gotta make this thing absolutely massive, boys. We're making a mansion running water. Of hospitality so sweet. How big is it gonna be? How long? How long? How long? Yeah. Very long. How, how long are we gonna live in there, bro? Long as the Nile River, decade, 100 years. Dude, I'm not leaving, bro. Bro, let's We're run in there. In there. Let's, this, let's run in there right now, go. Easy work, look at it. This looks like a normal Walmart right now. Normal, even less than normal, are you kidding me? It looks kind of small to be honest. We're trying to find where the, oh shoot dude. Look at this, two stories boys. Oh my gosh. That's why they call it the world's biggest bro. Holy moly. Dude. <laughs> I would yell, but I don't think I should yell. You know? No, 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 we, we, we gotta keep it low. If we get, if we get kicked out, this is the only world's biggest Walmart, so we yeah. can go to another one and film the video. Yeah, we, we can't just be like, oh, we'll just go to the other world's biggest right down the road. This is it. Oh my gosh, dude, it has escalators too right over there. A ball pit right here. I might have to jump in that later. But guys, look, up here, it looks like a whole Walmart, and then down here, it looks like another Walmart combined. At first, we were skeptical, but now that we see this, I believe, dude. They have a stinking elevator up in here. Oh my gosh, have you ever seen this? Oh my gosh, bro. Now we just have to locate the toilet paper because I think toilet paper, we have to go with the classic. It should be massive. We're hoping it's gonna be a big spot, not just a little a tiny small section. We're hoping it's gonna be big enough. Guys, what? It's gonna be a mansion. <sighs> okay, okay, okay. We gotta locate it though. We have to look through a quarter million square feet to find this. Oh, oh my gosh. We've been searching for a while and we finally found a good section. Look at this, the water bottle section, but it's not as good it's as it could be. It's not as good as it could be. They do have some of the world's biggest water bottles I've seen, but the sinking water bottle section, it's looking pretty normal, honestly. Couldn't go back at home and do this. Guys, water bottles are cold. We need insulation to keep us nice and warm. Look what we have here, this sinking toilet paper. We're gonna try to make it all the way down as long Dude, as we can. Dude, this is a massive section and I think it goes to the other side as well. Yes, it does. Two, three stories. We're gonna make this thing as long and as high as we can make it, boys. We came to the other side and this is more like it. There's a lot more empty space, giving us a lot more room to work with and we can put the extras up top right here. But there's a worker right, right there and the employee entrance is right here. So somehow, some way, we have to do this all when I can call right next to an employee's. The key when making a toilet paper for is clearing out the middle like this 
as much as you can. Don't worry about making it neat. You just gotta clear, clear, clear. And then you get one person to go in there and start shaping up the fort so you can have as much room as possible. So I'm gonna be the one going in. The boys are gonna watch out for employees so we don't get caught. And guys, this thing's looking real nice. I don't know how the employee did not see. Rick was literally moving toilet paper while the employee was right there. He, he left the aisle though, I think. Ricky, you're, you somehow made it. We got so lucky right there, but look how big this is. All we have to do is clear. We gotta start clearing fast. Go, to work, go, 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 to work. go, 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 go here. No, take all these out, take all those out. Take out, take out. I cleared this place out fully, but another worker came and he's restocking right across in the same aisle. He just left, so we gotta start making more progress. All of this first section is cleared, but I'm gonna work my way towards there, and then the next one, and the next one, and go as much as we can. But it's super busy right now. We moved down to the next section, and we got a new system going. I'm handing it to Rohan over there, and I'm handing it to Nick over here. And guys, we're making a lot of progress. This thing, so far, is almost one of the biggest forts we made and we're not even halfway done yet. The only one problem is there's a worker that keeps coming back and forth, restocking all of that over there. But luckily, every time they come by, Nick tells me and I barely ducked down just before they would see me. Me and Rohan have been out here trying to clear it out. Not really too sure what it's looking like in there, what one hit Rick has been up to. We're heading in. Send it in there. How? Good question. Yeah, I don't know. I'm not so really sure. quality that we don't know how we're gonna get in. One hit Rick. Someone say you need an opening right here. Oh. Oh. Chill, dude. An employee just walked by when Ricky did that. that I'm going in though. One hit, bro. What was that? What was that? That was a little uh, one hut by the one hit. Oh I'm my. What doing. I don't know okay. either. That's okay, guys. I, you got RTV, Rohan. Chef RTV. Chef RTV oh, cooking oh, up the oh, wall. <laughs> a worker just walked by. A dude. worker just came up to me. He saw me moving it down there and he's like, good job, bro. Bro, we got so lucky. Ron's in here now and we're about to give you a quick tour of the place before we deck it out. So this is the biggest Walmart in the world, so we came all the way from Florida to come oh, up really? here. Really? Yeah. So you're hiding? Well, we're just doing a little she thing. Can hide playing yeah, a little thing. bit. Because our mom said, our mom said we could. Because she, we went on vacation in New York, and we were like, this is the one place we wanted to come. So you're photographing. So. Yeah, just a little. We're taking like cool pictures. Okay. Thank <laughs> you so much. We'll be out soon. No way, dude. He pushed down the wall, saw us in here, and he didn't even get mad at all. He was just like, he rebuilt the wall for us. He rebuilt Put it. Put it back up. Boy of the year goes to Ernest, man. Dude, look up. Look up. Look this way. What the... Dude, this Dang thing's dude. massive, huh? This thing's massive. Look at this. Freaking mansion like Oh, that's it, that's it. We gotta give you the tour right now. We got the first section right over here. This is a normal toilet paper fort, but that's just the start of ours. We got another one right over here. And if you look down, there's some nasty, nasty stuff, mm. but that's because we haven't decorated yet. And then Nick's gonna show you this side. All right, if you come over here, we have a nice little secret room over here. Not much, not much. We have a nice little loofah just for decorations before we fully deck it out. And then the throne, this is where the king sits right here. You sit up like this. Then we got more over here. Guys, over here, Chef Rohan, you already know. We got the fridge right here. Got no, bro, bro, bro. We don't have anything yet, dude. Oh, wait, then we're gonna add it later. Oh, so we're gonna put a fridge in here? Oh yeah, for real. Over here, there's really not much more. As you guys can see, it's just more rafter, just more space. We're gonna add to it. I don't really know. And take them further back, dude. Take them further back. There's a stinking attic over here, guys. This is pretty much Narnia. Take a look, take a look. You need some energy, you can take some energy. There's a quarter million square feet. This is already a hundred million square feet. So we already have more room in this fort than the whole thing. And we got some friends out here, you know. But now we're gonna go get some stuff so we can actually make this thing like a house. Not a house, dude. A mansion. There was one loofah light in there from previous owners, but now we gotta add another loofah light. I think we're gonna go with uh, every single color they got. Just a few, huh? Just a few. Loofah lights are key. Everything downstairs is mainly groceries. The boys have to go back up if we wanna deck it out. No, two, two, two. Oh, here we go. We got this random green thing right here, but we can't show you everything else we're getting. You're also a spoiled tour, but we'll see you guys back downstairs. We got some big stuff going in, but in the world's biggest Walmart, you gotta put oh big stuff in there. Whoa, whoa, save it for the tour. Oh, my bad, my bad. 
Yee yee guys, welcome to quite possibly the best IBP crib store ever. Come on in, come on in, I'll show you. Easily the biggest one. You come through here, and on the left, I got myself a little fan, doesn't work, and I also got a little lamp. Also doesn't work. So you're like, Ricky, how is this? There's the best not thing? even a light in there, dude. Yeah, no light in here, but it doesn't matter because this is what I got. Every one of us decorated our own section, so mine looks bad right now. But then you whip open the barn. Yeah. You got a barn? Boom. Whoa. Willow the pony. She just chose right in here. I feed her some uh some on nest quick whenever she wants to, you know. She also loves eating half eaten Reese snacks, so just toss it in there whenever she wants. Throws it right back. Oh. Close the barn. Then she goes right on her merry way. And that's my section for you. Then we're gonna show you Nick's section over here. We don't have too much going on, but we do have a nice little nature theme, nature pillows. And this right here, the Symbol Green All-Purpose Cleaner. What is this for, you may ask? It's to keep the merch so looking clean. Honestly, the merch is so clean though, it cleans the cleaner. And in the common ground, we don't have too much going on. We don't really do anything in it, but lay down. And we have Lufa Lanterns across the whole entire fort. Come on down and Chef Rohan will show you his section. All right guys, Chef Rohan in the building. Business booming, Washington booming. But anyway, we are in the kitchen right now. One hit Rick Ninja, Nick hired me. You already know I make up that fire. But over here, we got the utensils. We got the pots and pans. We got the refrigerator and the oven. But to be honest with you, they're just pillows. I don't know what they're doing. They don't help at all. The very secret key ingredient right there, boys. Pre-made, pre-cooked comes right out in a very green, disgusting ooze. These boys eat absolute no idea what they're doing. This I don't have to do anything. Big Huss helps me. This guy works so hard, man. He always takes his time whipping up the curry, and me and Nick pay him a pretty penny, man. But he is so good at what he does. I truly appreciate you. Oh, it's all in here, boys. Yes, Nothing man. Else. The okay. best thing about Rohan is he never pre cooks anything, he always makes it from scratch, right, Rohan? Right. This place was absolutely crazy. By far, my favorite fort to make just because it's so sprawled out. Every person has their own section. Most of the time you're like this in a toilet paper fort. This time we're all sprawled out and comfortable, but it's already been a few hours in here. And as you guys know, we're on a road trip. If you didn't know that, then you're probably not subscribed to our vlog channel. On our vlog channel, we do a bunch of extra crazy stuff behind the scenes, bring you on adventures. And we actually did something where we slid down mall escalators. And there's an escalator in this Walmart, so we can't pass up the opportunity. And since we haven't got kicked out yet, I think we got to send. We're going to go get an air mattress and a pump, blow it up, and send send down an escalator on an air mattress in Walmart. We can't pass this opportunity up. But right now, we gotta clean up, guys, because after this, it's almost a guaranteed kick out. We're getting kicked out of the world's biggest Walmart. Something I've dreamed about since I was a young lad. I got kicked out of so many Walmarts. Not the world's biggest yet. One day, one day, Rich, you will get kicked out of the world's biggest. One day. That's so loud. In the middle of a Walmart right now. That is all blown up. One hit Rick is lacing up his shoes. He cannot be slipping out there because last time he went down the world's biggest escalator and did it and he literally burnt a hole in his shoe. Yep, I did, bro. But this one, it's not as high, but it's in a Walmart. So everyone's gonna be like, what? Wait, what? What? Oh, what? No one even noticed. No one even noticed. No notice. Nick has time to send me. Am I sending? I think you're sending, bro. Take it back. Oh over shoot. Okay. I thought we would get instant kick out, but Dude, looks no. like Nick's going for number two right now. Punch with your final. Yay! Oh. Woo! Oh. Our TV is the last one to go. Excuse me, can't do that. Thank okay. You. Okay. Oh. Oh shoot, oh shoot boys. I think she's gonna stop our TV. She's going to stop our TV. Will he get the send in? Will he get the send or not? Can we, can we take the mattress with us? 
we, we fought it though. RTV didn't get a send, boys. Dang, bro. It's I was good. about to whip up some curry going down for the boys. Mid ride, you were gonna whip up some curry? Yes, bro. Thanks so much for watching, guys. Everyone watching to the end right now, you guys are the real ones. And big time shout out to the fan of the week right here, right there, guys. If you wanna be fan of the week, all you have to do, follow us on Instagram, tag us in a picture. That's all you gotta do, guys. And comment down below if there's anything else you guys wanna see us do with this air mattress, because that was pretty crazy. But one hit Rick always wants to take it up a notch. And thank you to the Bud RTV for helping us film it. We're headed to Ohio next. Can't wait to see everybody actually in Kentucky for the meetup. Let's go. If you guys want to follow us on our journey across the entire United States of America, subscribe to our second channel, Ireland Boys. The link is in the top of the description. We love you guys. And until next time. <laughs>